from some rookie nookie to virgins, which is a new show following a group of women in the big city pushing the boundaries of their East African culture. He was just passing by, so he just gave me a ride. Well, did you give him a ride too? This may be her first rodeo, but Nadia looks the best for inspiration. I mean, the first name that popped up was Viola Davis. I think because she's so fearless and vulnerable on screen, that's just something that I aspire to be. So Nadia, how would you describe the series? Well, I think it's daring because you don't really get to experience a lot of Af East African culture typically. I would say that it's fun, and I would say it's a little messy. <laughs> it's a little messy, <laughs> but it's okay, I love it. Posada had an interesting story getting cast on the show. I know the creator of the show, Aiden, for like my entire life, and I've watched her develop it over this five, six years. Amazing. And it had come to me a couple times. I just didn't feel like I was ready. And then finally I saw it was on CBC Gem and I was like, damn, I think I just <laughs> that. <laughs> that made you ready. No, I, I did it, but I was like, no, I can't go in there and be like, oh, I'm here. Luckily, she's amazing enough to reach out to me and always believed in me and, and I auditioned and I got it and it was, and then now I'm here with Nadia and Tracy. Yeah. yeah. Having people she could relate to on set made a huge impact. This was all what, predominantly women, sorry, and it was predominantly people of color. As well as that, like I got to meet some friends <laughs> <laughs> and I got to really connect with individuals that I don't think I would have if I didn't have this experience, you mm -hmm. know? And that atmosphere of relatability extends to her character, Sarah. I did it. <laughs> did it? Did what exactly? Yes. She has a little journey of her own. <laughs> yes. And it's not always the prettiest, but I would say what I can relate to the most is the fact that there are elements that she kind of keeps from her family to maintain the peace. And so I, relatable. Exactly. Mm -hmm. I think everyone does it because they don't want to, you know, make their parents upset. And I think Sarah does that a bit too much, I would say. But I think I do it a reasonable amount. <laughs>